Hi, in this video we'll take a look at how you can uh, uh, import uh, proxy files in GSA Search Engine Ranker and uh, do it automatically on a schedule. Um, basically this will be used for maybe you have an external proxy scraper and they serve the proxies to a file for you. Uh, or maybe you have uh, a proxy file that you update uh, say a couple of times a day or or somebody send your proxies uh, all the time that needs to be updated uh, this is how you will do do it in GSA search engine ranker uh, basically the same can, can be used for GSA SEO indexer or GSA old redirect pro so what we do in the GSA search engine ranker as we go to the options uh, before I go on my proxies that I have uh, all in my Dropbox folder uh, because I have a VPS uh, uh, running which basically saves the proxies for me every uh, hour uh, in uh, my Dropbox so I pull the proxies uh, from here and then I use them in my various uh, programs so I will be using this file and this file updates every uh, every hour uh, there's new files in there so how do we do that in GSA search engine ranker option I'm sorry uh, go to configure for the proxy section um, <coughs> we go to add edit sites um, you can uncheck all of these, check none, unless you specifically want to use them all in addition to your own. And then um, when we add, make sure the check m check mark is, is, is over here, pass all. Okay, so we go to add, single. I know it asks for earlier, but instead type in a name for what you want to call this. I will call it, say, Asia virtual solutions proxies proxies and click OK um, you see uh, it will be added in there and it show up there now many people use SOC 5 proxies but if you just uh, import it uh, like from here from import from file it does not always classify the SOC 5 proxies correctly you can use this method to import your SOX5 proxies and let and uh, have them correctly specified in GSA search engine ranker as SOX5. Uh, but since by doing that you will select SOX5 yes, if you have a SOX5 proxy file. But uh, for me or any of these other options, but my file is just uh, mainly uh, HTTP proxies, uh, so I'll just leave it on auto and basically everything else you leave as default here if however you have a private proxy uh, file that update and you can just check this but mine is public pu public proxies that are scraped updating every hour so I will mark them as private so now we have that and it shows they pass all we have this auto everything else just leave it now what we do is to get to our file click pass file now and on the drop down here it will open a browser so I'm gonna browse to uh, I'm here already to my Dropbox and select that file which updates uh, uh, every hour and uh, click OK and voila we are basically done almost so next we have to now tell GSA search engine ranker how often to pull that file and to do that is click options we say we automatically want to search for new proxies every 60 minutes or pff, up to you but my proxy file updates every hour so I'll leave it uh, at maybe uh, just leave it at 60 minutes and then uh, I'll just uh, test it uh, again I want to test everything uh, mine is only public proxies so only the I'm going to test everything, all good and bad. Uh, I want to 
uh, we can check for anonymous um, we can remove non-working proxies and I want to remove the dead ones also every hour so they don't sit in there for too long I try to use keep alive I'm not sure this works and at the top here only check automatically disable public proxies when to believe detected to be down you don't have to worry about threats since we're pulling a local file I'm not passing a O uh, but if we were I would uh, just leave it as it is okay so we are done with the settings here now we go back to our list and on add proxy we click on add find and test so it will find it will look for that file that we specified it will pull the proxies and uh, it will test uh, those proxies now it says searching for proxies it found 1300 1003 proxies in my file and uh, it's now quickly testing those uh, proxies and uh, checking uh, anonymity and uh, basically that's it um, if you were using a, say a program called uh, uh, Old Redirect Pro or GSA SEO Indexer you c it's basically exactly the same in the proxy configuration as GSA Search Engine Ranker so you can pull that file into all of your GSA uh, programs that you want to do and uh, every hour now it will repeat this process or if you want it to, to be every uh, 30 minutes it will pull the file every 30 minutes or even even every two minutes if you want um, and check the proxies for you and that's basically it and that's how we uh, use an, a local or external file uh, to pull proxies in GSA search engine anchor Okay, if you have questions, shoot me a note. Uh, if I can, I will answer them for you. Okay, have a good day and uh, thank you very much.